How's it going everyone? Welcome back to Graham Games and this is Super Toss the Turtle, a new mobile game that literally just came out earlier today. Lots of you probably know the original game just called Toss the Turtle. It came out on Newgrounds years ago and I've always been a little bit jealous because it well and ahead outperformed my own pirate launch game. But that's just because it was a great game, so I can't be mad at it for doing its job well. If any of you never played the original Toss the Turtle, then likely you guys probably saw Markiplier's video on it earlier this year, and then you probably went and played it. So pretty much everyone probably played the original Toss the Turtle. But now we have the sequel on mobile devices. Wow, that's like a really uh, narrow window. Oh, that was not a good first launch. Oh yeah, you gotta get your little, you get your extra little shots. Press and hold to control speed. Hmm. How so? How, wh what was I contributing there? I don't know, I, I guess I can kind of try and direct him a little bit to try and uh, push him towards different obstacles and stuff. Anyways, pretty weak first run, I'd say. It is a pretty standard launch game, but it's extra violent, and then there's like a million different weapons and items to unlock. And then there's a million different things that you can run into while you're skipping across the ground. So there's a lot to see in this game. I accidentally just clicked on this and it tried to share it to Facebook. So apparently you can share when you do really well. Free? Free plus 15%? Confirm purchase? I'll buy that. Cash that you make from now on will be multiplied. <laughs> that must just be because it's a new release of the game. So there's a little bonus starting thing. Oh hey, that's cool. I, I, I'm, I'm happy with that. Get us moving along here more quickly. Unlock a random character for every hundred shells that you collect. Holy shit, how many, how many characters are there? There is quite a few to go through. Awesome. I don't know how to get shells, but I'm going to start working towards that. It's most effective to shoot the character on the way down. Get that upward momentum going, makes sense. I like to do these nice like 45 degree angle launches. Ah, fuck, not a good... Not great again. I have not learned how to use this slingshot very effectively. Oh, see, there I there I got him a little bit there. Oh, I finally got boosted by something. I just don't know what the fuck I hit. But I did get a slingshot, an extra slingshot bonus there. Come on. Get the money. Get the little bomb. Get the bomb. Oh, he was so close. At least I finally I, I picked up some money. There we go. New best. Got some money. Maybe I can actually buy some sort of upgrades, make myself a little bit better here. Well, I can't afford anything. Most things aren't even available to me right now. And most things are expensive. But you can see there's a shitload of items in this game. Plus $50 for the effort? That's that's nice. I'm, I'm glad that my efforts are, are being at least a little bit appreciated. And then I get my cash boost. That's gonna add up quickly if I actually start, you know, making making any sort of real distance. Ooh, a new, new, uh, new desert world. Fuck, oh god, I'm not good at timing that. Nowhere near the max. New present? Just for playing? Just for no reason? A fancy gentleman Gooba gave me 25 shells? I only, I only have 25. Hey, you can spend real money to go unlock a bunch of them. Alright, well I better make them five minutes count then. Holy shit, look at that dead android in the background. He looks fucking hardcore. That's just like a random little something in the background there. New present again. I don't know why. This game's really dishing out though. I want a new character soon. 666 bucks. Right on. Oh, that was like slightly better. Still pretty much sucked. Oh, you can watch ads to get things. I might do that later on. Not right now. Right now I got that timer that I gotta worry about. I wanna make the most use that I can out of that. Oh, there we go. That was better than I have been doing. Get the shell. Oh, you stupid piece of shit turtle. Is that, that's gotta count for like 10 shells or something, right? That's, there's no way that's only gonna count for one. New present again, it just keeps dishing out. Well, in that case, I am gonna watch an ad. Great, now I, now I have 100 shells, now let's go buy a new character. I will roll those 100, see which random guy we get. Look at him, cool! Aww, he's so cute! I, what, do I get to know what his name is? Patrick. Patrick, what's the what's the turtle called? Did he just call the turtle or something? It tossed the turtle. Is this guy from a game or anything? I don't know, but I love him. He's got a little fez. He's got such stumpy little arms and legs. I love him. I'm I I would much rather be tossing Patrick than tossing the turtle. No, and now it's slightly Christmassy. I can pretend this is a Christmas episode now, thanks to that little this one little winter scene. Poor Patrick, sorry you're getting your ass kicked there. Oh, I'm gonna go more horizontal than usual. 
I want to. I want to shoot him with a slingshot. That was the worst. Oh, get it, get it. Fuck. All right. Well, I got money at least, but I missed the bomb. You gross little frog. But he's got. He's got quite the plump little ass, considering he's a little frog. Is it oh, 61? 61 different achievements to be unlocked. Just thought I'd take a quick peek. Hey. Oh, I finally, finally chained together some things. This is it, boys. This is where we make it to the big leagues. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, fuck. I missed the bomb. Uh, getting the money is nice, but you want you want to get those max distances, you know. If you, you miss out on that, you're missing out on so much other stuff that you could possibly be banging around into. Oh, sweet! There we go. Get it, get it, get it! Oh, what the fuck? Come on, little pelican! Oh, there's a one of those gentleman goobas just floating around in the balloon up there. There's also deadly. Sp death spike balls floating around on the balloon so I guess I can't just bank on the fact that a balloon is always gonna help me out I gotta do it on a case-by-case case. close Patrick as cute as you are buddy I'm, I'm gonna go back to the turtle but I can afford something so I have a classic revolver it carries four rounds and I uh, presumably it'll bash me along a little bit better than just the fucking Slingshot would have. I'm trying to move things along quickly because I only I have that timer on that thing where I get the bonus cash. That's a little bit better. I can get a little bit further using this here. Oh, I finally hit a gooba. Money. Oh, fuck. It probably wasn't worth it to stop for the money. I should have kept should have kept barreling on forwards. Fuck. Oh, nice little pelican. I, I've gotten better at using the gun rather than firing them all off really quickly. It just narrowly avoided those spikes. You space them out a little bit, so it's at like the bottom of each of his little arcs. I was panically just clicking them all together really, really fast before, and I, I knew that wasn't the right way to do it, but I was just getting a little overzealous, I suppose. Come on! Yes! Yeah! Just barely got it. Ooh, a nice big cash bag. Fuck! Oh, I almost slowed, my down, slowed myself down enough to get the pelican. Come on! Yeah! <laughs> I beat it by one meter! Suck my dick, old record! Oh, I fucking- I, I did it! I, I finally did it exactly to the maximum! I even got an achievement to confirm for myself, because I wasn't absolutely sure if I had done it at first. Oh, cool, chained together a couple pelicans and stuff. I gotta stop- I gotta stop holding myself up like that for the money. I probably could have gotten a new record by like one more meter again if I hadn't slowed myself down. Well, I got to $2,000 a lot more quickly the second time around. Shh, fucking really shitty rounds like that certainly aren't gonna help. Holy shit! Um, oh, I wasn't ready for it. I- I didn't- I wasn't sure what was gonna happen. This big awesome cool whale, I thought he was gonna automatically do something on his own. I wasn't prepared to use his blowhole. Oh, fuck. Oh, that little bomb. I'm, I'm glad to get the boost, but I missed out on a shell because of it. Fuck, I missed the tank. That tank could have been... It, it probably would have, like... I think that was from the old game. You can reshoot yourself with the tank. Fuck, that would have been helpful. I think I got a max again there. Fucking great at this now. I just had to get back in the swing of things. It's been a long time since I played Toss the Turtle. It just you just gotta remember how to play. Fuck Patrick, I'm never going back. Turtle all the way. Unless I unlock another character, then I'm probably gonna play as the new character. Oh, so it looks like my cash booster run out. I got seven hundred and nineteen from it. That's like that's not terrible, I guess. I I wonder if I should have saved it for later on when I was making more money so that the fifteen percent or whatever it was would have been worth more. But it would have taken me longer to get there, so eh, either or, I guess. Holy shit, this fucking fire plant lava area looks fucking incredible. Jesus, this is this is my favorite favorite world or whatever from this game so far. This looks fucking sweet. It's like a lava jungle. I love it. Man, now that Gonzo is done with this, and presumably he'll be supporting this game for a little while, they've talked about maybe porting it to Steam, something like that. I would love to see him do like a side-scrolling beat 'em up or something, like a full a full game version, like his very own Castle Crashers style game in his art style. Fuck, I would love that. Oh man, a little gun shooting dog, a, a gang hound. <laughs> gang hound just gave me a boost. It just made me think. That I I think he has a, a couple dogs that he likes to insert in all of his games, and that was probably his actual dog there that he inserted in this game, which is really cool. I had a slight issue with my recorder for a minute there, so I just lost about 15 minutes or so of me playing the game. 
Uh, so just to catch you guys up, I'm not sure exactly where I would have lost the footage, but I now have this slingshot, I have this chest bomb, and I'm playing as a penguin. He's jolly toes instead of happy feet. Get it? Because I didn't. Not right away at least. So I can, I still got my gun, and the chest bomb I can activate at any time to give myself an extra little boost. Great. Fucking sweet. Tooth, toothed wall. That's great. Great way to die. I'm glad you look as fucking mangled as you do, you deserve it. Also, turns out those tanks that you just saw fly by, those aren't helpful. They just run you over. There might be some way to get into the tank, but I didn't do it last time. I just got ran the fuck over. Holy shit! What do I do? What do I do? Oh, tap, 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 tap. Shit, okay. I was, just had to panically start start doing something. I don't think I can click a mouse as much as I, as, as fast as I can tap my fingers. Oh shit, look at all that cash I just missed. Oh yeah, you can see here I got 26 shells. That's because that one is from getting a shell bouncing around on the screen. You actually literally only earn them one at a time. The soda jetpack. Fuck it. I'll just keep buying things as they come along. It seems to be working out for me pretty well so far. Alright, little penguin, let's give this jetpack a try. What the fuck? <laughs> that, they can't have been related to the jetpack, right? Because that's the most dog shit upgrade I've ever paid for. That was not worth eight grand. Seriously though, can this guy come and squash you at any fucking time? That seems a little unfair. What if I was about to break a record? What do I do to avoid that? Fuck him. Fuck the thwomp. I've never really been one for in-app purchases, so I'd rather just watch an ad now and again. That seems easier to me than investing like this money to buy the shells. So I sit down and watch an ad, whatever, it's 20 seconds of my life or whatever it works out to be. I get to earn some shells, presumably Gonzo gets some money out of it. Win-win. Oh, what the fuck? Not again? At least he thwomped me into some money. Fuck this guy. <laughs> fuck him forever. <laughs> Where, where do I buy swamp insurance? Some kind of swamp proofing. I think that's the first time I actually got stuck on the spikes. The floor spikes at least, there's other spikes I've been stuck on. Oh, I actually bang, banked off the tank and got a boost. I think that was from hitting the tank. There might have been something else back there, but it seemed like the tank helped for once. Alright, I'm going to try and use this while I'm low on momentum. Wow, does it ever not add a lot. <laughs> I guess I shouldn't have expected much. It's Mentos in a Coke bottle. Not, it's really not gonna be a very effective jetpack. I missed, I dodged a thwomp! I don't know how, just go fast enough? Fucking hey, that looked like dad from dad and me. Big chainsaw wielding son of a bitch. I, thanks buddy, I, I, I don't normally like getting chainsawed, but I certainly do when you pretty much double my score. That's fucking sweet. Ah, shit. I think in the original Toss the Turtle, there was Dad from Dad and Me, the old Newgrounds game with the purple guy, skull face, wields a chainsaw. That looked like it was an homage to that. That didn't look like it was actually that character. So many of these ads do such a terrible job at trying to explain to me how their game is fun. That didn't look fun. 10,000 bucks, I can buy new guns? Midnight Pistol. Those nights where you don't want anyone to know you're packing heat. Not as strong as the Rustic Revolver but extra bullets come in handy. There's like the tips for this game and one of them is use the gun to help avoid obstacles. I don't have the reaction time to do that. Have you seen the speed at which shit comes flying past you in this game? I'm just shooting it at my guy to try and get like three extra meters out of him. It's just one extra bullet. I don't know if that'll that'll be worth it. I might as well stick with it. I think, I think the game is probably balanced in a way that they know that that extra stuff is worth it. Yeah, fucking the Nana, Nana Hadouken or whatever. <laughs> fucking banana, no! No, I got banana Hadouken to the game pros. That was gonna be a huge run! Hit it, hit it. Oh, perfect. Oh, two of them. Nice. Book of Bombs. Is that, I, I doubt it has to do with specifically with chaining those two together, but maybe it just has to do with hitting lots of bombs. Nice! Yeah, keep that shit up. It's gonna take a lot more than that. Oh, big bomb! Yeah, that's exactly what I meant. It's gonna take a lot more than that to make it further in this level. A big, huge motherfucker of a bomb would certainly do it. Come on, don't die on me now, penguin. This has been such a good run. We got two bomb-related achievements. He's gonna die on the floor. Oh, come on! 
Ah, oh, you stupid, you stupid jolly toes. Who can be mad at your jolly toes? Hit 20 bombs. Oh, oh, this is what it was talking about, that some achievements come with bonus powers. I, I fuck, I, I didn't think to actually go read the achievement things now. Oh, shit. So when I hit the, the Goombas, the Nabobs, 10% more bounce, bombs, 10% more bomb power, possibly including the Fat Man, so I might have got 110% out of the Fat Man bomb there. I'm a big fan of achievements in games, I'm a big fan of achievements tied to rewards. Improving the way the game is played is a really cool idea, I am just used to it usually earning you like a ha hat, or like an aesthetic uh, upgrade or something. Having it affect the way the game's played is fucking cool. It's actually worthwhile to chuck yourself into the spikes at the end like that because you get a hundred extra gold. If you know the run's over anyways, fuck it. Oh, let's go watch an ad and I can unlock a new character. Well, that's clearly just an assassin from Assassin's Creed. That's that hunter lady from Warcraft 3. Those are just a bunch of countries from Earth. And that's just the pumpkin from Charlie Brown's Pumpkin Patch Christmas or whatever the fuck that was. Just a bunch of rehashed garbage is what I'm getting at. Alright, give me a pirate. I want to unlock a pirate. Bonkers? Instead of conquer, we got bonkers the squirrel. I'm okay with that. I'm a fan of squirrels. Part of me wants there to be a pirate that looks vaguely like the pirate from Pirate Launch. Because it would just make me feel good to have that vague, just a tiny little bit of recognition. But Toss the Turtles, like, clearly a superior game. So, I wouldn't be surprised if Gonzo or the developers of this haven't actually played Pirate Launch. Oh my god, this guy, he makes goofy little sounds. Holy shit, that, did I just fucking hit the sun? I hit the angry sun! But also, this guy has some of my favorite uh, goofy little injured drawings. He just looks hilarious. Look how cute he is. I fucking love Bonkers the Squirrel. Bum bum bum! This game is getting more exciting and more interesting the longer I play it. First time using Bonkers, already got a record breaker. This would actually be a little bit easier on mobile because you would be able to have two different hands tapping at once. You can have one hand doing this directional thing while the other one like taps you for the guns and taps the bottom things to activate it. It's probably actually a little bit harder to do with the mouse. Whoa, look at that big fucking diglet! I'm super mad I missed the ginormous grumpy looking diglet. Fuck. Just so many so many times missing out on things in this game. Damn it. Oh sweet. I wanted to make it at least as far as the next cannon. I there's like this is gonna take days or weeks of playing this game to unlock everything. So I just wanna settle in long enough to show like a decent range of things. The Patriot found this baby in a museum a while back. It still works, I think. So it went from a clown launcher to a giant slingshot to a, a, a historic relic, and then a, a giant bow and arrow. I wouldn't guess that one thing is actually better than the other. If you, if you laid those all out for me and told me to put them in order of which you think would launch something the furthest, it might not be the order I'd put them in. Fuck you, Thwomp. You're not gonna get me this time. Ah, shit, I missed a little diglet again. Who the fuck was that? Just a guy riding around in a jeep? Thanks for the help, buddy! Your reckless driving may have just earned me a new record! Come on! Ooh! Silver... Silver Nabob! I, I upgraded that once more. Might as well hit the spikes! Ah, oh, not quite far enough. New record, though. Wow, does that princess ever look fucking out of place? That was a Wizard of Oz game? Apparently now they just make Candy Crush and then take like a cardboard cutout of a human being, slip it in the game and say that it's some intellectual property other than Candy Crush. Can't wait until Gonzo sells out and makes Toss the X-Men. A lot of forward momentum going on here. Oh, it's losing steam. You can keep it going bonkers. Come on, buddy. Oh, son of a bitch. Bonkers sounds a little bit like Togepi when he when he launches. Listen listen to it here. I I guess you get lo rocketed on fire when you when you launch out of the cannon perfectly. Fucking fuck! Oh god, it's hard to get that going large enough. What was that? What were all the gold blocks that I just gathered up there? Holy shit! This run is going super super well for me. Keep it going, man. Don't hit any fucking spikes or anything now. Please. Please don't. You gotta keep this shit going. Oh, I just barely missed a big angry sun. Come on. 
This is the record setter. This is the run of a lifetime. You don't want to ruin it for me now, do you, bonkers? Oh, 2,000. We cracked 2,000. What is with that fucking huge fleet of pelicans that were just flying by just then? Oh, man, I'm getting way too excited about this. Come on, come on, buddy. We're in this together. Do it. You can do it. Keep it going. Just those inches longer. Just the tiniest bit. Oh, you can do it. <laughs> is that even worth it? Is it gonna... I just want, like, a jeep to fly out of nowhere or something while I'm keeping myself alive those extra few meters. Boom! That was a huge new record. I'll celebrate by watching an ad. Finally, finally! Is that... Is that all it was? Doink? That was kind of pathetic, wasn't it? I was really expecting a lot more out of that. Hit Potato Head. Not a Diglett, guys, he's a Potato Head. But I do get to buy a fancy new gun. <laughs> Holy shit, this fucking shotgun's pretty hardcore. <laughs> Boomstick, sorry, it's not a shotgun. My, my mistake. I keep setting myself these arbitrary new goals, like, I'll play till I get the next cannon, but then I'm pretty close to getting the next gun, might as well do that. Right now I'm playing until I unlock the next character, but I really just have to wait until it offers up showing me ads. So in the meantime, I might end up unlocking more things. Who the fuck knows? This game just is the definition of addicting. Shit, I just got a bunch of really lucky shit in a row there. Oh fuck, I got a jeep and then a and then fucking chain together a couple birds and then a big alien. Big angry sun. I already used up all my power-ups and shit, but if I can just keep chaining together shit like this, then I'm I'm gravy, baby. I think people say. I don't really think that's a thing. Oh, I guess we'll just die underneath this snowman. Holy shit, I'm going sideways so fucking fast here. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck, yeah. Oh man, I fuck, I, I never get a ton out of the alien spaceship. Maybe I do though, that seemed to have helped a fucking lot. Really kept me going forward, that's for sure. That was two records really close together there. I'm getting fucking good at this shit. What the shit did I just fucking crash into? Just an airplane made out of spikes? What kind of dog shit was that? The Black Baron, he just covers himself in spikes, hey? That's just his thing? Alright, I earned myself enough shells to go unlock one more character. We'll give some new guy a couple runs worth of tries. The Grape Soda Man. I got the Grape Soda Man. <laughs> From the screenshots I've seen, this is the fucking stupidest, most hilarious character. I'm so happy I got him. Yes. Secretly, this was all I wanted. I just wanted one more character so I could maybe get Grape Soda Man. Here we go, Grape Soda Man. Oh, you're looking good. Good form. Oh man, he takes everything like a champ. Doesn't even hurt him. He just flexes harder when he gets hit by things. He's unstoppable. No one can fuck with Grape Soda Man. <laughs> except, for, except for that. Royal Raccoon? What does that mean? What is it showing me? God damn, god damn that spike trap. <laughs> things are going so well for me. <laughs> you nice sexy oiled up grape soda man. Earlier when I said I want it, I want Gonzo to make some sort of castle crashers beat em up style game. I want grape soda man <laughs> to be the main character. He's clearly the best. <laughs> I don't care how, but this guy's making it into the thumbnail for this video. He just has to. I just gotta pick one of these sexy poses. He's, I feel like he's just posing just for me. I get, I get to take the pick of the litter. Oh, maybe it'll be that nice. It'll either be this nice triumphant, triumphant pose, or it's like one of those guys. New present, fucking a. And I get to buy a new rifle. This belonged to my great great grandfather. Must be worth a lot by now. Well, I'm gonna take grape soda out one more time. Sniper rifle him a few times in his beautiful behind and see if we can set ourselves a new record. And by one more time, I meant one more time. At least until we get one more good run. You don't want to end on a dud. Holy shit, I hit the thing hard enough that I think it actually made something happen. It actually, it does more when you hit it harder, I guess. Oh, fuck yeah, chainsaw guy. All right, this is the run we were looking for. This is the, this is the end all run. This is the one where we make we make history, or we we fizzle out like a like an old stale pop and are forgotten. No matter how hard we flex, not not everyone's gonna be a winner. 
Honestly, this is the type of game I could just sit down and play over and over and over again, and that's the, the, the major appeal of it. It's 100% free in the App Store now, you guys can go download it yourselves, and you guys can go spend your whole evening on it like I probably will. But I gotta, I gotta cut it off somewhere else, I will just sit here and keep playing it. So thank you guys all so much for watching, I'll see you again soon.